Hello everybody, E here. Uh, this is a different type of video. Um, I wanted to uh, put out a PSA for constant readers and constant collectors of Stephen King merchandise and books and all that stuff. There is currently a bootleg version of Rage going around. Um, I was informed by a friend, a follower of the channel, um, and they thought that they had came come across um, a, a super crazy fantastic deal, which was a paperback copy of the first edition of Rage for $1.50. Um, I will get into this, what, what I think happened and what I think is going on, but all of that is alleged. What I know for certain, and I will link my evidence down there in the doobly-doo and pin the, uh, well, I won't pin a comment, I'll just put it in the description of the Twitter thread for this. Um, so when I was emailed by this person, and I don't want to give them any flack, so I'm not mentioning them. If you want to tell people yourself, you can say it, and I will pin your comment. But this person emailed me and said, hey... Uh, Amazon is selling Rage for a dollar fifty, um, and if you have Prime, it is free shipping. Um, so the total amount that I paid was one dollar and sixty-two cents for this copy of Rage. Now, um, the issue with this is Rage has been out of print for ever since uh, shortly after Columbine happened. Uh, Stephen King unpublished the book because he didn't want it out there because uh, the shooters. Um, cited not only certain games and other books, but they cited Rage as one of the reasons why they did what they did. Um, now, I'm of the mindset that uh, I don't believe that video games and books can be blamed for this type of thing. It just it's, it all falls back on the individual, just to be clear. And I won't go into the, the, the details and the history here. While there is something to be said about archiving books like this um, and making them available, Stephen King does not want this book out there. Um, so ha however you come across this book in your own illegal ways, I, I have no control over that. But I would say respect the man's wishes um, and do not buy this. Um, the, I bought it to see if it was a scam, um, to see if they would actually ship the copy. I didn't think they would, but they did. I have the proof right here. Now, a couple things to note in this one. First off, it's your average Create Space Amazon Vanity Press published book. Um, it's got a very cheap matte cover, which is nothing like the original. Um, but if you look inside, you will see that it has first printing, right here, first printing, and then the number line with the one included, which means uh, resellers are selling this on eBay and on Amazon as a brand new first printing first edition that is incorrect this is a bootleg copy now a after quite a bit of diving into this um, not only had they already removed the listing um, I did screenshot my receipt for it that I bought off Amazon and it's in the uh, Twitter thread that I'm linking down there in the in the doobly-doo um, they removed that one but now what's popping up and what I want you guys to be aware of, especially you collectors out there, is they are selling this book as new or like new or out of the box but new on eBay and Amazon for over $200. And it is this exact copy. It does not share an ISBN with the original book. It is uh, the ISBN itself is in this new one. It is not the same ISBN that's in the book as is on Amazon. They are different ISBNs. That because that's because this book most likely was scanned using a book using book scanning technology, where they go page by page by page. It is a very cheap, cheap copy. Um, the you can't really tell on here, but the image is blown out. It's uh, not very detailed. If even if I go up. You can see how blurry it is, even though I'm shaking. Sorry, it's I just shake anyways. Um, it is a very blurry, uh, low-res image. Um, if you come across, the my final warning here is if you come across Rage by Richard Bachman or you know Stephen King, if you come across this copy, it is a bootleg copy. It is not legit. Now, the problem stems not only from piracy, 
but the fact that they are trying to sell this as a collectible copy for over two hundred dollars now dollar fifty i wouldn't have been too worried about it because amazon would eventually take it down and they did but I, what I worry about is some of you guys out there, my fellow constant readers and collectors, are going to go out and buy this book thinking they're getting a first edition because they can take a picture of the copyright page to show you that it is a first edition. But when you get it, it is not a first edition. These books are no longer being, this book is no longer being published whatsoever. Not in the Bachman Books collection and certainly not individually. Um, so I didn't want, I wasn't going to say anything, um, when it was just a dollar fifty because I didn't want a whole bunch of people going out and buying these bootleg copies. First, King's not going to see the money. Second off, you know, he doesn't want the book out there. Um, and while, while I say that dollar fifty wouldn't be such a big deal, um, it's nowhere near as upsetting as seeing people reselling this as a first, first, first edition, you know, first printing for $200, $300. So please be careful. Please be mindful. If you ever see this book labeled as new, it is a bootleg. Just keep that in mind. I hope this helps, and I hope none of you have been tricked so far. But until next time, I have been E, you have been you. This has been a random PSA. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.